Okay, uh, week two, beer two. Uh, this one is uh, Blue Moon, Light Sky. This is their uh, first, uh, that I know about, first attempt at a light beer. Um, this is uh, 95 calories, uh, 3.6 grams of carbs, and 4% ABV. Uh, Blue Moon actually uh, originated in uh, 1995 uh, <laughs> at uh, Coors Field uh, in Colorado. Um, this is an American wheat ale. So a couple things about American wheat ale. Um, that's supposed to be, you know, we talked uh, the last video. I talked about the uh, German purity law, meaning that in in Germany they're they're largely dictated by uh, barley hops and uh, uh, water. Uh, in case of a wheat ale, uh, up to 30% of of the malt can be wheat. Um, so. Um, these are usually unfiltered. Uh, they're kind of cloudy, supposed to be kind of cloudy looking, um, but it's supposed to be a little bit more hoppier. Uh, American wheat ale is hoppier than, uh, than a traditional Hefeweizen. Um, and they call that the Hefeweizen because of the specific yeast that's used. Um, in, in America, we couldn't, the, the guys that started making the, uh, the uh, wheat beers, they couldn't get their hands on that particular style of, of yeast. Uh, so it's kind of a, a little bit more, uh, clear, I think, maybe, a, um, I want to say, a cleaner taste than the traditional uh, German Hefeweizen because that particular yeast, it's called uh, it's called uh, Wiesen yeast, and it actually gives that that uh, kind of banana, clove type uh, uh, taste to, to the beers. Uh, but these actually take on additional flavors like, uh, you know, regular Blue Moon they made with orange peel. Uh, this one they make with tangerine peel. Um, and Again, 95 calories compared to a regular Blue Moon, which is 170. So, um, you know, pretty uh, pretty good deal as far as the calories go. So, I've had this before, and I really like it. And I like it enough that I wanted to share this uh, review because, uh, to me, um, this is pretty strong as far as a low-calorie beer. So, um, so you can see, uh, compared to the last one we talked about, how cloudy that is. Uh, there's a, and again, not filtered. So um, it's got, you know, um, when you go ahead and, and have a taste of it or smell it, you know, you can smell the tangerine uh, peel and uh, there's coriander uh, as well. It's kind of a, uh, yeah, see, when I drink a beer like this, I think of summer, <clears throat> excuse me. And, uh, you know, it does have, uh, it does have that, that kind of wheat beer kind of, you know, if you've ever had a wheat beer, you know, they kind of have that, uh, I think, kind of like a bread taste uh, and uh, and kind of a, you know, an overtone of that coriander you can pick up. Uh, but this is really, really good beer, uh, especially for the, the calories and so on and so forth. Um, as far as aroma, you know, I, 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 I'll go ahead and hit a, hit a four on that. Uh, the color is, you know, pretty much spot on for a, for a wheat ale, so I'm going to give that a three. Uh, again, these aren't supposed to be bitter, um, and this one is not. Um, so if you're not into IPA, not into hoppy beers, you would definitely enjoy this. Um, like I said, that, that tangerine, uh, citrus type uh, taste kind of really makes you think of summer, and especially this time of year, you probably need all that we can get. Um, so as far as should it be better? No. Is it better? No. Um, so, you know, it gets pretty high marks there. And like I said, the taste is just... For me, it's really, really good. I, I, I like wheat beer anyway, so um, that's probably how I ended up weighing 380 pounds because those are pretty high calorie, uh, you know, but for something like that to have this low calorie is really strong. So I give that a four. Um, basically, I'm going to give this an a 15 out of 20. And is it an American wheat ale? Yeah, I mean, it, it looks like it's supposed to. It tastes like it's supposed to. Um, it's really well executed, so I think this one... And like I said, uh, definitely a keeper. So this is uh, Blue Moon uh, Light Sky uh, by, again, by, uh, owned by Molson Coors.